Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am here with Raid Shadow Legends. Yes, I have been sucked in to the hype. I'm basically going to come in here and take a look to see just what this thing's about. I keep seeing the advertisements coming up on my channel. I see them on TV. I see them everywhere. It looks interesting. It looks like your typical RPG. I'm not normally into the big, massive multiplayer online games because usually what ends up happening is you run into a bunch of knuckleheads that are high power that take all your stuff and leave you with nothing. And that's what I hate to deal with. I hate that. I like more cooperative or single player. But this looks like it might have a single player aspect. I don't know that much about it. I do know that I really like the commercials. They're funny. <laughs> They're awesomely funny. And my favorite character in those is that skeleton. He's just he's just too cool. The skeleton's awesome. I also like that orc lady. She's she's interesting. <laughs> but anyway, let's check this out. I did go through a little bitty introduction to this where a whole bunch of your people were killed and it takes you to this point. It says you need to choose your first champion but one champion is not an army. So we need to choose a mystery shard to summon other champions at the portal. Now I hope the sound isn't too loud here guys. Haven't quite figured out the settings here. So if I can turn the music down I will if I can figure out how. But this is the Arbiter. She's the one that's in the commercial where she's getting ticked off I think at the skeleton guy. I don't know what his name, but he he's awesome. But let's see. We're supposed to go to this, the portal, or we go to battle. So I don't know what this is about. Apparently we have a certain amount of time. So mystery shard. So mystery shard, common, uncommon, rare. I don't know what this is for. So we gotta click this apparently. You summoned an attack type champion with great attack and support skills. Let's head to the campaign map and prepare your champions for their first taste of combat. So sniper level one, dark elves. So what do I need to do here? Oh. So I need to go over here. It looks like I got another one I can use, mystery shard. Nope, I can't do it. They're making me walk through here which is good I need to know how to do this boosted summons okay so we need to go battle somebody and apparently we have six seconds to do that so let's go into the campaign I guess Behold. Karak Castle, seat of King Tabor. This is where your journey begins. Okay. Do we still have a limit? Yep. So I hope I'm doing this right. Apparently there was some free person you could get. But I didn't see anything about that, so I probably did that all wrong. I don't know anything about the settings. Like I said. I fear that the king and his banner lords have fallen to the shadow. Once noble and just, he has brought war upon his allies and ruin on his people. You and your champions must fight through his banner lords, find him, and see if he has turned to Siroth. Alright, so we gotta go to Castle... Karak Castle. Before I go any further, let me see if there's anything here about settings. What is this? Ah, rare skill tome, bastion... Normal. Let's see, I've actually made this. I don't see anything to change the settings, guys, that I can find. Well, if anybody can help me with that, let me know, because I would like to turn the music down. I'm just afraid it's too loud. But. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump in here and see what we can do. Eleven generations of peace had reigned between the kingdom of Karak and the realm of Aravia. 
A peace now shattered by King Taba's brutal campaign of expansion into the neutral lands between the two kingdoms. Once revered as a pillar of justice, King Taba had imposed crushing taxes to finance his war with his former ally, bringing desolation and ruin upon his own people. Had the king lost all reason? On the orders of the Arbiter, the company set out to persuade him to renounce his folly and wayward policies, even if it meant storming the very gates of Kirok Castle. Karok will not fall easily. Like all places in Teleria, there are multiple stages of defenders. You must defeat all stages to move forward with your journey. Okay, so they are definitely walking me through. Now, some of you people are probably going, Oh, wow, good God, he's such a noob. <laughs> and I am. I am a noob. When it comes to this, I am a noob. But, you know, you got to take me with seven days to die. I think I will definitely kick your butt on that. So... And fishing planet, yeah. Hey, you know what can I say? Anyway, let's let's jump in here and see what happens, guys. This is where you select your team and review the enemy champions before each battle. Each champion has unique skills and an affinity that makes them weak or strong against another affinity. Okay. So next. Magic beats spirit. Spirit beats force. Force beats magic. And Void is special. Void champions have no direct weaknesses against other affinities. So, sp magic beats spirit, spirit beats force, force beats magic. It's like rock, paper, scissors, isn't it? <laughs> rock, paper, scissors. I guess this is Spock. Void is Spock. Oh, I'm such a nerd. You have only two champions. Let us pick your team. Well, she is the most powerful, so I am going to grab her and her. Well done. Notice that your leader has an aura skill. These provide special bonuses to all allied champions in a battle. All right, let's see what happens. I'm probably going to get my butt handed to me. The arrows above each enemy's head show how your champion's affinity matches up against theirs. An affinity advantage means a more effective attack, more damage, and a higher chance to crit. <coughs> Critical, I guess. So let's see here. What should I do here? Enemy team. No buffs or rebuffs. Wow, she's tough. And that's all she wrote. Valley of Death? Rain of Arrows. Okay, see, this is auto. I'm just kind of getting the idea here, guys. Demoralizing display. Ooh, damn. So that was an easy victory. But I did it automatically. Only reason I did that is because I wanted to get a hang of what's going on. Let me go ahead and replay it now. Wait a minute, let's grab the reward though. Excellent. Campaign levels drop artifacts, and here's your first. Artifacts are powerful items that boost your champion stats. Along with special items, your champions will earn XP after every battle. Earn enough and they'll level up, growing in strength and power. Okay, Bastion. Well, I'm going to keep following the orders of what it's doing. Alright, back to the Go Bastion. Go to your champion collection and equip that artifact. Okay, so champion collection. How do I do that? Next? Oh, okay. So that was the portal. I'm trying to get all this in my brain here. This is where you can view all champions under your control. I 
she's pretty. Each champion can equip up to six artifacts. Select the artifact and equip your champion. Okay, so we're gonna equip Elf Thing level one. That's my leader with this. See that? Your artifact has already strengthened this champion. Better yet, artifacts can be equipped in sets to provide special bonuses and effects. Cool. So we need I believe you are ready. Return to Karok Castle, seat of King Tabor of Karok. Fight through his banner lords and find him. I must know if he has succumbed to the shadow. Only the shadow knows. Okay, let's check this out. Yeah, we only have two, so we pretty much they are our choice. Oh, so they, they do all that automatically? Okay, so I can choose to do this. So what scream? Oh, he means he's about dead. He's dead. He's dead. Okay, cool. I like it. <laughs> okay, let's see. She's the first to choose. Can she choose what she... Okay, let's try this one. Eh. Ooh, ooh. Ouch. Ow. Ooh. Damn it. Okay. Let's try something new this time. This this woman is taking fewer hits. Okay, we're almost we're almost to the end of this now. Boom. <laughs> Congratulations, you leveled up. Every time you level up, you'll get full energy, gems, and sometimes you'll even unlock new features. And here are your rewards from battle. With this artifact, you'll have enough to equip a full set. Let's go. So back to the Bastion. Champions. Artifacts can be equipped individually, but come in sets of two or four. Equipping full sets can give you huge stat boosts, special abilities, or add special modifiers to your attacks. Ooh, some kind of a uh, helmet. Upgrade? Well, let's just hit the equip like they're telling us to, so... Special icons will show which artifact sets a champion is equipped with. Tap on the set icon to read more about which bonuses it gives to your champions. This set boosts your champion's HP by 15%. Life artifacts come in sets of two, meaning you can gain a huge 45% HP boost with three sets. Let's upgrade this artifact and improve its bonuses. So you can upgrade this, that's what I was asking about. Excellent work. When you upgrade artifacts to certain levels, they gain new substats, giving your champions an even bigger boost. Cool. You have learned well. Keep strengthening your warriors. I shall return in time to teach you more. Delania Chase. Okay, apparently you can get her. So we can click that. Starter pack. Uh, don't really want a starter pack. But you get 750k, you get 
30 HP boosts, whatever these void shards are, and ancient shards. Hmm. Progress mission available. Keep progressing to win rewards. Sorry about the dogs, they're still clear stage 7 of Kirok Castle on normal. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what these things are. It says miscellaneous drops. It's a duelist level 1. I mean, do I have these as part of my... I don't know. It doesn't really tell me. Well, I'm definitely, when I get to stage 5, going to need more than 2. So, let me see. What's this? Silver? Summons a rare champion. This is an Axeman level 1. Maybe it just opens them up so that you can choose choose them or something. I don't know. Conqueror level 1. Let's see, she's got... She's a healer. Oh, her heals by 20% of the damage inflicted. That's cool. Stunning Slice level 2. Commander level 1. Quick heal, that could be useful. Holy fire, so she's like a spiritual type person. Interesting. And that's what the colors mean. I guess the... Interesting. Okay, well let's... I don't know what this means, but that can't mean something good. Let's see if we can't do this battle again and do it a little faster this time. So I only have those champions right now. So let's go ahead and start. Now guys, if you can give me some tips on this, what's the best techniques? Okay, this this guy's kick ass, I think. I think the green is a magic user, but I'm not 100% certain about that. Can you switch? No, you gotta choose whoever's the leader, so... Let's... Let's take this guy out first. And... let's see... Ooh! Boom! Damn! Ow! Okay, I'm still learning this. Damn, she is a badass. Oh, provoke. Yes. Let's go with this. Okay, we're getting stronger and stronger here. Ooh, what is that? Okay, they're getting stronger. take this guy out here. Whew. 
Eh, it was a little closer, and s the sniper took quite a few hits. No, wait a minute. Now we're gonna go back. To the bastion, that's it. Oh, plain free gift. Got mystery shard. Take that. Can we? S well, let's see if we can't summon another one. Oh, nice. Ranger's always good. Makes a nice mix of stuff. Yeah, we want to step her powers up a little bit. Let's see if we can't... We got artifacts. Mm. I thought we picked up some artifacts. Okay, you gotta help me out here, guys, a little bit. I have got... How can I improve her skills? Steel. Let's upgrade that. Ah. Ooh, and we just got new rewards. We got this, magic brew, a shield, and another weapon. Which means we can improve our champions even more. She needs something special. give her something more to play with. So they've each got, except for her, I need to give her another artifact. Let's give her that. Now 
we can't get an upgrade. She's got to fight first. All right. Challenges. Summon a magic champion. Uh, I don't know how these work yet, guys. Maybe what's her name will come out and tell me a little bit more. Make four artifact accessory upgrade attempts. There we go. So I just got some of that back. Awesome. So apparently these kind of tell you what you're supposed to do or where you're advancing. I don't know. What am I supposed to do here? Anything? Epic, legendary, rare. Whew. So these are characters that you can earn, I guess. Well, let's go ahead and battle, guys. I can't wait to be able to do legends. That, I mean, dungeons. That's going to be fun. Okay, so let's try stage three. Wait a minute. Team set up. How do I change? Oh, we can only have two. Let's go ahead and start. Alright, let's see if we can't take this happy fella out. Yep, there's one down. Ooh, headbutt. Damn, that was mean. Valley of Death. There's that guy down. Sharpa, Sea Rate, and Blunted Arrow. Ooh. Damn it. Okay, we got a little bit of a healing going on there. Let's try this one. Wait a minute, no, let's try that one. Okay, he's out. Slowly healing. Okay, which is the more powerful? Okay, she's down a little bit. Demoralizing display. Oh, great. She's got a shield. Yeah, I need a healer. Let's see, double shot, rain of arrows. Let's try rain of arrows. Keen shot. Yeah, she's more of a healer, and she's actually making it better for them. But I think I can take him out. And she is pretty much left helpless. Let's try 
try the Valley of Death. Ooh, damn! It's the first time I've lost one. Oh. So you didn't lose the character, it looks like. So we can edit the team if we so desire. She is badass. She's not bad either, but I want to try my new character here. And get her leveled up a little bit. Let's try an auto and see just how powerful she is. Ouch, ouch. Holy oh, crap. Whew. It's a stun arrow. Demoralizing display. Yeah, she is tough. She's got that healing capability that gives them an advantage. Truth be known, it'd be better to take her out first. She still hasn't leveled up, but... Okay guys, I'm not sure what to do from this point, but I think this character needs to get a little bit more shielding, so to speak. So we're going to equip that. We dropped... I'm not going to do any upgrades right now. I'm not real clear, clear on how that's done just yet and she's going to get an upgrade too. Let's see. No. That's a much better weapon. Let's see. That's much better for her. Okay, well, I guess she'll have to get it. Okay, well, I think everybody's been upgraded, leveled, as much as we can at this point. I'm sure I'm not doing this very well, guys, but I am trying. I've been able to complete every level up to this point. Playtime rewards. That just tells us when the next reward is available. And I just got more silver, so I'm back up to where I need silver again. Ah, oh, I want Delania Chase. She is a badass promo codes.
daily login rewards. So I need to log in as much as I can. So you can get plenty of rewards to keep this doing going. Summon some legends. Anyway, there's more to this. This is really cool, guys. This really is kind of cool. Uh, it, it, it's very Dungeons and Dragony, uh, that's for sure. I don't know what all these other things are, but I'm still learning. If you give me any advice of what to do, I would greatly appreciate it. I mean. Okay, so that's... Yeah, I don't understand all that stuff. The more help you can give me, the better, guys. I would greatly appreciate that. Oh, looks like I got some more gifts. Rarity charm. Rank charm. Full energy and a whole bunch of silver. <laughs> so you gotta make sure you check these things. So she's level four. Yeah, we need to come up with names for these people instead of player blah 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 blah. That's kind of boring. Alright guys, well I hope you've enjoyed this first look at this for me anyway. I know you, there's people out there that have been playing this for quite some time and are calling me noob. You're seriously a noob. You made this mistake. You that, that made that mistake. And, um, I, you know, <laughs> it is what it is. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this first look. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with uh, maybe another episode if you guys want to see more of it. Maybe there's too much of this out there, but I at least thought I'd give it a try. Anyway, guys, I'll see you later. And as always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. Bye-bye.